Hi, I'm Scott Campbell, Director of Operations here at Stowe Monroe Falls City Schools. Over the course of the next few weeks, we'll be doing short video segments called Walk the Yard here on the iconic front yard of Stowe Monroe Falls High School. The short segments will be informational videos with personnel from the schools, city, and stakeholders to give you the clear facts on our operational levy that goes on ballot November 8th. Good afternoon. My name is Scott Campbell, Director of Operations for Stowe Monroe Falls City School District. We're here at Stowe Monroe Falls High School with another segment of Walk the Yard. Today, I got a great guest, Band Director, Mr. Greg Newman. How are we doing, Greg? Doing great. Good. Good. To see you. Awesome. Thank you so much for joining us. My pleasure. Obviously, we've been talking about opportunities, and one of the biggest opportunities we can offer kids here is band. Yeah. So, how long have you been? band director here at Stowe Monroe Falls City Schools. This is year 27 for me. Uh, I've started as assistant high school band director and then moved to the middle school for about 10 years and, and now director of bands. So 27. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. And we know that the performing arts is a huge part of what we do in our schools and what we provide people. And what we've been talking about is these opportunities. Can you kind of talk about how big of an opportunity and how big of a program that you are actually operating here. Sure, sure. Well, band is a big part of, of what we do here in, in the school district. Uh, we start almost 35 to 40 percent of our, our fifth graders and fifth grade through 12th grade we have a little over 700 students combined. Oh, so it's, it's quite a big opportunity as the students get uh, older and into middle school. There's jazz band, there's other performing opportunities for them that, that really give them the ability to stretch and spread their wings musically. That's amazing. And we know that we, we listened to Dr. Hartman just a couple days ago and he talked about you know, there's something here for everyone. So I think when you talk about these different ensembles, what does that really do for a student in giving them an opportunity here? Sure, well, uh, through the, through the uh, different performances that the students have here, specifically at the high school, whether it's performing at Cleveland Brown Stadium or the Horseshoe down at Ohio State or on our home turf here at uh, Marhofer Stadium, um, or even in a sit-down setting at the American Celebration Concerts. There's just so many uh, different ways that the students can uh, get involved in opportunities that, again, just really allow them to, to grow and uh, be diverse and, and that kind of thing. So we're really, we're really pleased with that. Yeah, and, and that's amazing. And then the last thing is this. As we talked about, these kids are able to leave out of here with an unbelievable experience. And so what we want to ask you is, by be able to offer all these opportunities for them, how does it allow one to maybe chase their passion, whether it be in performing arts or in the music? Sure, well, in a team building environment like we have in band, uh, it, it really builds a lot of life skills. Um, yes, we develop wonderful musicians, but it's more than that. It's, it's work ethic, it's the ability to take something from ground zero to a performance level and uh, it just those are those are life skills yes. so it, it really uh, develops the students uh, not only their creative minds but also uh, their critical thinking and, and, and that kind of thing so again it's just a very diverse uh, opportunity for them to be involved in and, and this continues to be a theme of what we've been saying from what we are producing here in the Stowe Monroe Falls City Schools is just better bulldogs that are prepared to go out there yep. and, and do whatever it is that they want to ensue after they leave here. Greg, any last things that you like to say for anybody that's out there? Just, I can tell you, please go out and vote. Uh, we are recognized as one of the best communities of music education in the state of Ohio, and we want to continue that tradition for as long as we possibly can. So appreciate your support. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right.